Uh, I'm Tony. If you've been to class on Friday, you know who I am. If you haven't been to class on Friday, you might still know who I am. If you don't know who I am, I'm Tony, and this is Jaden. Jaden the Articulate, we call him. Okay, technique number two. In this technique, we're pretending that Jaden has larger girth than he does, and my legs are shorter than they actually are, which means I'm struggling to keep my legs, my clothes guard around Jaden. So my, I end up something like this. Everybody's experienced this. I've experienced it. Uh, in this case, it, it's making it difficult for us to hold our closed guard and, and for the closed guard to be effective. And probably, if you don't like the closed guard so much, um, this is why. You're trying to do closed guard from what is effectively open guard. From here, Jaden can just stand up and walk backwards and he's out of my guard. So it's not really effective at this point. To combat this, what we're going to do is we are going to change our position a little bit and we're going to take a cross grip on his arm and the other hand is going to come around here and take a grip on his cuff again. And this time what our legs are going to do is we're going to come to a position here. So here it controls this foot here is hooked around underneath Jaden's armpit and my leg, my knee is like a knee shield across his chest. So I'm controlling his movement somewhat. He can get up and move away from me, but that risks a scissor sweep and I can still hold on to him. I've got his leg here, I've got this grip here and I've got my hook around there. We don't really want to stay here too long. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take our knee and we're going to slide it under his armpit. Note that I've still got my hook around him, still got this leg, still got the cuff, still got this cuff. What we're going to do then is we're going to split our legs and we're going to use this hand to help us pull Jaden this way. So now I've got a hook over his back, my foot is actually on his chest, this, uh, uh, this knee is in his armpit and it is almost kimuraing his arm. This is how you need to be. And I've still got his cuff. To sweep him from here, what we want to do is we want to put our knee on the floor. So his shoulder is on the floor. And we want to take this leg and this, take this leg with his arm, punch it up to the ceiling. This leg is going to come over here like an omoplata. Basically our whole body is going to turn this way. So to do the sweep, still got his arm, still got his leg, sitting on his chest. My shin is on his arm. You're not going to stay like this. Probably what you want to do here, maybe come around to mount. Something like that. Okay, from this angle, we're gonna swap to this knee position. We've got a hook here, my leg here, and I've got his cuff. Got his cuff. We slide our knee under his armpit, and we split our legs. To sweep, our knee goes to the floor, our hand goes up into the air, and our leg, our other foot, follows over. 